Hey yo, this is Dash, and this is your opportunity to ask me anything you want to. Well, almost anything. If you guys don't know, if you weren't around for last year, during the month of December, when barbecue views are down, we got to do something to help get those views back up. That being said, what I'm going to do for the month of December is you guys get to ask me almost anything. So all you have to do is leave a comment down below, ask me a question, and I hopefully will get to respond to it in the form of a video. So don't be bashful. It really won't take more than about half the month to hopefully get enough questions for me to answer and do a video every single day. I really would like for you to ask me a question down in the comments below. Thanks as always for watching, and I hope to answer your question soon. Hey yo, this is Dash, and here we go. We're starting it, we're doing it, we're doing the Ask Dash series. Now, before I get started, I need to put my phone on vibrate because I'm getting more messages and, and, and questions from you guys and honestly <laughs> I'm blown away so today is gonna be the first in many 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 of the ask dash videos and I guess I will just give you guys a quick explanation as quick as I can do because I like to talk for December all 31 days of December I'm going to answer a question at least one question sometimes I'll answer more than one question especially if Kirk <laughs> has more than one question. And tonight's question is gonna be from Kirk and also from Jimmy. So Kirk from Shorebilly Barbecue and Jimmy from Cuff and Stuff. Now I've talked to both of them or, or excuse me, I've talked to Kirk. There's the video that Kirk was in. Hey yo, this is Dash and I can't see the actual camera cause I'm being blinded by the sun, but th this, this is Kirk. This is Kirk from the Eastern Shore. Shore Barely Barbecue. <laughs> Hi. <Hey -o. laughs> and for Jimmy, I'm going to post some information about his channel down below. So let's try to get into these questions. Now, Kirk asked a few different questions, and I'm going to tie both of the, the questions from Kirk as well as from Jimmy in together because they asked. All right. So Kirk says, what's your lamb recipe? All right. So Kirk has been asking me about my lamb recipe for a few years and he, this seems to be his go-to question. So first thing I do is put a little F in it and then I, I take and then I add a little bit of U, all right? And that's, that's, that's the magic that happens and poof, all right? <laughs> all right, so then he says, how many pickled peppers did Peter Pepper, Peter Piper pick? So I think last year he asked the same question or similar question and we asked Alexa. So what I want you to do is ask Alexa, how many, Alexa, how many peppers can Peter Piper pick? Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. But that helpful? Yes. Great, thank you. All right, so it was a peck of pickled peppers. All right, so there's two from Kirk and also, see, we got her started. So then Jimmy, and to tie Jimmy's question in, he says, what's the secret of cooking lamb to perfection? Cooking the temperature. To me, lamb needs to be cooked to like a medium, medium rare. Uh, so you're looking at between like 135 and 140 degrees. Your mileage may vary. You're gonna have to figure out how you like your lamb. And when you figure out how you like your lamb, that's how you can kind of stick with it. When I cook lamb, I typically cook lamb to about 140 degrees, depending on if I'm cooking it for a customer, if I'm cooking it for for myself, for my family, I might cook it a little, 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 a little less, a little more rare, to about 135 degrees. Uh, then I also have some customers that request me to cook it a little more well done. So I might cook their lamb to 145 or 150 degrees. Again, it's up to you. And when I'm speaking of lamb, I'm talking about leg of lamb, the boneless leg of lamb that I typically cook. Uh, again, I usually cook the ones that are cooked, being cooked for me, uh, for uh, me and my family, I cook them to about 135, 138 at absolute most. 
and any customer cooks, I typically cook that lamb to about 140 degrees, unless someone specifically asks me to cook a little more well done, then I'll cook it to 145, maybe even 150, depending on the customer and what they ask for. Hopefully that helps. All right, first episode of S-In The Books.